Hey guys, I'm going to explain how I made my DIY air intake for my Honda Navi. This cost me about $35 to $40 total, so very cheap. It sounds great, and I haven't had any issues with it so far. So I'm going to have links to everything that you need down below. But basically what you need is a 1.5 inch uh, silicone tube. So I got this one here, uh, which is a 90 degree elbow, and it has a 4 inch by 4 inch leg and you have kind of some options you can do either this 90 degree here or you can just have one a small tube sticking out this way and you know have your air filter kind of sitting right behind it here i just like this look and it kind of keeps it away from the exhaust and i figured it's more you know in line with the airflow so i went with this version uh this was about you know you can find them for like ten dollars on amazon uh just make sure that it's a 38 millimeter inner diameter tube and you can, you know, kind of get whatever you want. For the air filter, this was $10 on Amazon. This is a 48 millimeter uh, air filter. So basically you just want to make sure that this air filter goes over whatever tube that you're getting. So if it's, you know, I just measured my tube here. It was 48 millimeter outer diameter. And then I just bought a 48 millimeter filter and it came with its own clamp and I was able to clamp it on. So this is the other thing that's completely optional, I don't think you really need it, is a bracket like this. The man in the box uh, intake came with one, so I just kind of took inspiration from that. It's just a piece of aluminum that I cut to shape and then bolted into the uh, swing arm bolt right here. It's threaded on both sides, so I just stuck a bolt in from the back. And then I 3D printed a, a little collar that goes around the tube and uh you know just kind of holds it up not sure if it's really super helpful but i think it looks pretty cool i uh, just threw a coat of paint over it and called it a day uh, so next up what you need are the crankcase and the cvt breathers uh you know, the stock system has all this stuff running back into the intake just for emissions you know to burn everything back uh, from any vapors that are made from the PCV or the CVT. So what I did was I got a 12 millimeter air filter, um, it's about four or five dollars on eBay, and then just cut the stock tube short and then bolted that on. It came with its own clamp. And now this one is a dirt bike gas tank breather tube, uh, or breather vent, I should say, sorry. And this one literally just plugs right into the the tube that I also cut short. And yeah, that's it. Uh, I think everything, you know, including hardware, costs under $40. If you shop around, maybe even able to get things for under 30. Uh, everything sounds great uh, and it's a lot of fun to ride. I did have to rejet my carb after doing this because I did lose some top speed. So I had to go to a bigger uh, pilot and main jet. So just something to keep in mind, you may not need to, depending on your elevation and temperatures and stuff. Anyway, I hope that helps. Uh, let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. Thanks.